Hello everyone, food for thought. You know, I learned that um, Singapore is at the top of performance academically in the world in three subjects, the STEM subjects. They're at the top of any educational system in the world. And there's a lot of energy. There's a lot of time. There's a lot of sacrifice that is put into this to achieve that goal, to achieve that standard and to maintain that standard. It takes tremendous sacrifice. It takes tremendous pressure. It, 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 it exudes tremendous pressure on the children that are destined to perform at these levels. A lot of them end up with psychological issues, depression, even suicide. But there is a lot of energy and time and effort that is put into this to achieve this and then to maintain it. The pressure on the government, on the teachers, on the families and the community. There's a word that they use that says kiatsu parents. It's a Chinese word. It means afraid to lose. This is what motivates them. Fear. To achieve this level and to maintain it, 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 they're motivated by fear. But the Bible says in Matthew 8, 36, What good is it for someone to gain the whole world, yet forfeit their soul? All this energy, all this time, all this sacrifice to achieve what? To maintain a certain status, to maintain a certain level of integrity and community essence community standard for what purpose let us think about putting that amount of energy and time like the singaporeans do but that time and energy let us put that in loving one another in caring for one another in sharing the love of christ with one another let us put that type of energy because then we will not be stressed or depressed we will not seek out the psychologist and the psychiatrist we will seek jesus we will seek the will of god let us be responsible for one another god bless you